Hello YouTubers, RugmonKey Jr. here. Now, Apex Legends is quite the phenomenon since it launched last Monday, and we already have a year one roadmap for what is to come for Apex Legends. So much like uh, Fortnite and PUBG, it will have a battle pass, more than likely offering access to some exclusive skins or things of the sorts. And there will also be seasons for Apex Legends, again, much like Fortnite. So there will be four seasons uh, for the year one roadmap roadmap, the first one starting in March, then June, September, and finally December, and with each season there will be new legends, new weapons, new loot, and the battle pass. Now I hope that the new legends won't be exclusive to the battle pass because I think that would probably hurt the game quite a bit but I doubt that they're gonna do that. But then again, you never know. I also imagine somewhere throughout the year there will probably be either a rework of the map and adding new locations or an entirely new map. Um, obviously, at some point, playing the same map over and over again can be boring. I mean, the game just came out. I'm not bored of the map whatsoever. I love the map design of King's Canyon. It is fantastic with all the elevation and all the spots to go. And the ways to get around the map are great. But after a couple of months, a map like that might get a little bit stale for a lot of people, myself included. So I would imagine there's going to be a new map sprinkled in somewhere around there. And also, uh, this is a great way from what we've seen with Fortnite and other games to keep people invested in the game. Especially if the Battle Pass offers a lot of things to unlock, like through 100 tiers, like in Fortnite, you get through the 100 tiers and you get stuff for each tier, something like that, I'm not too sure. So hopefully the Battle Pass is actually worth it and like, that you can even purchase it with the in-game currency that you earn by playing games and not only be purchasable with like you know, the Apex coins for like, who knows, $10, I would imagine the Battle Pass is going to be, give or take. Uh, so hopefully there's a lot of stuff to do with the Battle Pass, and hopefully like they don't lock the new legends and new weapons behind microtransactions. I doubt it. Uh, I think it'll only be uh, probably cosmetic items or some cool, unique stuff that you can't get unless you bought the Battle Pass. So I can see this game going quite far the way they have it planned out already. It's a nice roadmap for year one with the seasons. Uh, people are already incredibly invested in Apex Legends. It's a really fun game I've been playing for the past couple of days non-stop with my friends and we just can't get enough. And I'm actually working on a video about some of the things I love the most about Apex Legends. You should be able to see that over the week. Also probably some just regular gameplay of us winning matches. So keep your eyes peeled for that. Let me know your thoughts of the year one roadmap for Apex Legends in the comment section down below. Uh, hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and as always, thank you very much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.